To the people of northern Greece, Macedonia, the renown, is their second national anthem. The folk song celebrates an identity they cherish as much as Greekness itself. It's not just ancient history they're proud of. Their great-grandparents fought to wrest this land from the Ottoman Empire. These high schoolers have heard the family stories of sacrifice and bloodshed. They feel it's their duty to fight to keep the name Macedonia exclusively Greek. The Greeks feel they are defending themselves from a peculiar crime, the theft of a component of their nationhood. We cannot give away our property, our historical pride of being Greeks and Macedonians. Certain people cannot take what doesn't belong to them. I think sharing this name will be the biggest forgery in history. Macedonia is the soil where we stand. The stones say it, history says it. The archaeological record leaves no doubt. Here in Pella, buried beneath cotton fields, lies the 400 hectare ancient Macedonian capital. It is from here that Alexander the Great set out to conquer Asia. And a few miles to the south, archaeologists have found the royal tombs of the ancient Macedonian dynasty. Such finds do not exist outside Greece, but the talks between Athens and Skopje are designed to share Macedonian identity. The country that has called itself Republic of Macedonia since the Second World War would retain that name with a qualifier, such as Northern or Upper. Opinion polls suggest three quarters of Greeks are against that, unless the name is in the native Slavic tongue of the Yugoslav Macedonians. Greece has reasons to compromise. Its economy is in tatters after eight years of recession. It needs trading partners. And former Yugoslav Macedonia wants to enter the European Union and NATO. Cultivating good relations now could give Greece a better position in those organizations. And then there is Greece's real worry, the increasingly tense relationship with Turkey. As the country emerges from its economic crisis, it shapes an area in which it can act and with which it can grow. This is because it frees up strength to deal with the real geopolitical, geostrategic problems. These are not former Yugoslav, Macedonia or Albania. They come from the east. For these Greek Macedonians, however, history and identity matter above all else. John Saropoulos, Al Jazeera, Pella.